Hey everyone, I'm sorry I haven't been around lately. Um, again, like I said, I've had you know a lot to do, been trying to get back in the swing of things. I know I keep saying that, but I don't know. I've just been trying to, you know, do my best to work ahead. Uh, but basically, what I mean by that is, um, do more than what um my classes require me to do. So. I've been trying to do that all at once, and uh, it hasn't really worked out. But I did have an appointment with the writing center this morning, and um, that really helped me out a lot because I have steps now to focus on before summer vacation, which is um, a week after this coming Monday. And I've got some book recommendations um, from the writing center so I can at least get started there and along with additional research but I just feel that you know I'll be able to get back in touch with you guys more often you know like I did a couple of weeks ago now so again I'm I'm really sorry for the delay um, but right now I guess I could talk about what's been going on so far um, this week's actually been tougher than the last couple of weeks not counting um, not counting um, my aunt's, um, my uncle and aunt's kids that I've been, um, being, that I was around last week, um, you know, um, not counting that, um, I'm talking about school assignments, um, I've had a, I've had basically, you know, I've had a writing assignment due on Tuesday, and, had a long, had a couple long work shifts Sunday and Tuesday, and a short one on Monday. So that part of the week was pretty hectic, but uh, I don't have to work for the rest of the week, so it's cool. I'm cooling down a little. <laughs> um, but aside from the regular assignments, I've also had a peer review, which is where we review others, where we review um, other people's written work and. Um, we basically say what they've done right in terms of, you know, plot and characters and the right story structure elements, you know, if they're used properly, um, if all of them are used and if not, you know, what, whether that's good, whether that's bad, you know, uh, that kind of thing. Um, so aside from that, um, I've also been developing a short screenplay for, um, for one of my ideas that I came up with this month. And I looked at one idea at somebody else's um, screenplay. Um, our instructors um, gave us this. And I gotta say, it, it really does kind of make sense on how we're supposed to write these things. Um, screenplays. We've also gotten these um, screenplay screenwriting sheets to give us an idea of what the structure is like you know how we should write in all caps how should you know how it should be formatted how you know lines and character names and everything should be formatted so that's been interesting because you know you start off with a log line you build it into the screenplay you write the plot and then you start writing the dialogue I mean to me it's not really that bad but you know you want to have a lot of projects that you've done I mean, well, I mean, don't drive yourself insane, but yeah, you want to get a lot, a lot done, so I would say it's been pretty interesting for me so far. Um, ne next week is the last week, and I will be revising my portfolio piece um, that I had last week, so that'll be an interesting challenge. Um, I've also had um, a reading and analysis but, uh, hmm. can't remember what that's about right now. Um, oh, wait. We were going to see, it's to see, you know, how character development goes in flash fiction and screenplays. And in flash fiction, you kind of have to rush everything and just make it all short. But with screenplays, and, you know, for modern media formats like movies, TV, and video games, you can stretch it out and spend more time developing characters and add personalities and such. Well, that's all the time I have for today. Um, just let me know what you think in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this, and you all have a good day.